Alright guys, so we are hunting today. I am hunting on a pond in a blind. We've got an extremely, extremely strong north wind today. Today is like the coldest day of the year so far of 2016. Um, as far as like the duck hunting season goes, so it should be a really good day of hunting. We just got here, just threw my stuff down in the blind and we gotta put all the decoys out and uh, get set up. It is about 5.35 a.m. Shooting times, what time? 6.45. 6.45, so we're sitting around like an hour, an hour and 15 to kind of get everything situated, but it should be a fun day of hunting. Hey puppy, hey, hey. Hey, you gonna go get some ducks? Let's go. Got the one, that one's wounded. Was that the one we shot? Yeah, the last one. Okay, okay, he got it. You got it. Jesus, you did it. Hit it in the head. Yeah. So it's uh it's about nine o'clock right now. We shot two geese and one duck. Managed to lose the one duck and another goose. There's uh all surrounded around us is uh these cattails. We got the duck. Gadwell. Gadwell. Nice. Yep. Well, Austin, Austin uh, came to the rescue and got that duck. It only took 30, 30 minutes? 30 minutes to get one duck. I can't feel my hands. It was worth it. It's worth it. What are you eating? French toast with no syrup. Kill him. Fetch. There's a right behind you. <laughs> Playing peekaboo. Where's it at? Get it. Oh. Get it. Oh, it's so close. We lost the battle against that duck. Sadie, the poor dog over there, was fighting the 40 mile an hour wind and a diving duck, and it ended up going into the reeds. And the scent's blowing, or the wind is blowing so hard that she's having a hard time picking up the scent, so we ended up not being able to find that duck. But the good news is they're still flying and uh, hopefully hopefully the next duck that we shoot will dive once it hits the water so we can actually retrieve it. Kill him. Oh. 
Come here, Sadie. Good work, Sadie. Big goose. There we go. Look at that goose. That's a big one. That's a honker. Well, in all that chaos, uh, we got three geese. I was filming, and then I realized, there you go. Where's it at? Right there, we got a goose. I was filming, and I was gonna try to get them like falling once we killed them, but there were so many of them, I kind of got, I kind of got greedy, and I just dropped the camera and grabbed my gun. It's called uh, filming and hunting. Filming and hunting, right? You got to multitask at some point. So we got three of them. I don't know how many we're gonna retrieve. Two of them went over the trees, uh, and then we got one that was that was on the water. So good, uh, good shooting from the gang. I don't know if I hit anything, but you know, at least I tried. So we got one. We'll see if we can get the other two. There you go. I think uh, Jade Here. found a goose, huh? Shit. Look at that blood. Jade won the fight. <laughs> she won the fight. Alright, so we got Gadwell, Drake. Look at that. It's a beautiful duck. Pretty head. Pretty yeah, look at the head on that. So we got two. We got one there, and then there's one. One still that's got it. out there. Say, yeah, Sadie. Dog way over there's got that other one. Here you go. That's the, uh, the second duck. Kind of got hit in the eye. Is that a, is that a female? Yeah. That's a female. We got a male and a female. So it's noon now. We've we've ret we've shot five ducks, shot five geese, retrieved three ducks, and retrieved three geese. So we're getting better. We're getting a better ratio. We're making sure to kill them on the water, so they don't get away from the reeds. But so far, it's been a pretty good day, and uh, I still got still have quite a few hours left uh, in of daylight to shoot more birds. So right there, that's a goose. That's one of the geese that we wounded earlier. It's swimming. Went into the reeds again. Yep, it just opened into the reeds. We sent two dogs after it now. We're gonna see if we can get it. There you go, Sadie. Sadie got the goose. Goose down. Goose down. Well, I can't hear anything since uh, that kid decided to shoot his gun right here, but he uh, <laughs> he shot the goose. We found the goose. The dog scared the goose. We got the goose. Sadie, come. You got one. Come, Sadie. Good job, Sadie. Jade's dragging a decoy. Sadie, come. Sadie, come. You go, Mallard. And Mallard. And Mallard. We got Drake too. Drake on the other side. There, we got a hen and a Drake. Got a pair of them. Greenhead. Nice. Whoa, that is right. There's a duck point in the park. Somebody shot at this one and that comes closer. What do we got? Widgeon. Widgeon. We got a Widgeon. Look at the blue bill on that. Minus the blood. Nice. Here we got the uh, six duck retrieved, eight killed total. Goodness. All right, so it's two o'clock. This uh, hunt is brought to you by Campbell's Chunky Soup. We are gonna make some soup. How's the soup? It's good. It's real good. What we got? Drake Widgeon. Drake Widgeon. Shoot, shooting some Widgeons today, huh? Nice. 
two hours later. All right, so we are ending the hunting adventure. We hunted from sunrise to sunset. I think that might be the first time I've ever done that. That's uh, pretty pretty crazy, but it's still cold, it's still really cold. So I'm going to finish the recap of the hunting trip in the truck. So I am back in my truck, ending the video here. I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed this hunting video. This was definitely one of the best days of duck hunting and goose hunting I've ever really had um, as far as just numbers and uh, how many birds we saw and how many opportunities we had to shoot at them. It was just overall a really fun day minus my fingers being numb the entire time. Other than that, it was pretty awesome. If you guys are enjoying these hunting videos, leave a thumbs up and drop a comment down below. Um, that way I know to keep doing them. Also, if you live in Nebraska or Iowa or Kansas or South Dakota or anywhere just kind of around the, the Nebraska area and have a duck hunting and goose hunting spot and you'd like me to come out and shoot and film with you guys let me know just shoot me a message on social media uh preferably probably twitter you can also leave a comment down below here uh but if you dm me on twitter more than likely i'll be able to get back to you quicker so if you got any fire hunting spots within within like you know driving distance five six hours from omaha nebraska let me know because i would love to come out and hunt with some subscribers i've done a lot of fishing shows with subscribers and i like to do some hunting shows thank you guys so much for watching peace